All right, everybody, Bryce here coming at you with another real quick crypto market update. Uh, guys, what a fun, crazy, exciting week in the crypto markets, right? Not only have we seen some incredible popcorn price action on a lot of these altcoins, um, a lot of them look like this chart, right? Just up and to the right, all your key moving averages uh, aligned in a healthy way, valuations kind of starting to creep higher, a lot of momentum, uh, but you don't really see that retail frenzy, that sort of mania, you know, I'm not getting texts from from mom, or I'm not getting, you know, all these crazy calls from friends telling me, oh my God, Bitcoin's going crazy right now. It's just actually kind of like, it feels like not everybody's really paying attention. Not everybody's here. People are still skeptical. People think, you know, maybe this is the, the top and, and, you know, we're, we're just retracing uh, another leg down in the bear market. So there's still a healthy dose of skepticism. Uh, but prices keep grinding higher, okay? Despite that skepticism, prices keep kind of, you know, uh, on the altcoin world, you know, very violently going upwards and then kind of coming back down for a little bit and then making a new higher floor and violently going back upwards and coming down for a bit. But, you know, crypto um, large caps like Bitcoin and Ethereum have just been on kind of that steady uptrend up into the right. And this comes despite, you know, even, you know, bad news events. OK, and, and I think what's indicative of a bull market is climbing the wall of worry. Basically meaning when there's these big announcements that kind of come out in a bear market, you know, that would it would shock the price, things would sell off, everybody would be scared. But but you can tell we're in a bull market because when there's bad news, uh, the market actually kind of absorbs it and, and kind of keeps trending, you know, a little bit sideways to, to higher. And so the market is absorbing all that bad news, which is a key indication of, uh, of a bull market. Now, uh, you're like, what, what bad news? Well, did you guys hear about this crazy hack that happened the other day? Uh, with Ledger, right? Ledger um, kind of is the preeminent hardware wallet for crypto. I have a Ledger. I recommend my friends and family get Ledgers. I think it's a pretty good software. They've been riddled with some um, PR issues, I'll say, in the past. But broadly speaking, they've got a pretty good interface. But just the other day, uh, yesterday, uh, they unfortunately published some some malicious code that a hacker installed on their database. And, you know, at, at some point, um, if users had interacted with that application, um, they could have been drained of their funds. I think uh, it's all patched up by now, or I know it's all patched up now. Um, I think the, the hack was on the order of under a million dollars. So they, they did mitigate quite a bit of what could have been a really widespread attack. Um, but make sure you're always, you know, being extra careful when you're interacting with um, your wallets on, you know, make sure you know what uh, websites you're using um, and all that kind of stuff. And, and be very, very careful. This this sort of hack brings to light that everybody needs to move twice as slow and everybody needs to double check and triple check the, the things that they're uh, interacting with when it comes to crypto. So um, I think that that, you know, uh, even though that hack happened, you can see the price has kind of wobbled a little bit, but but broadly speaking, continue to grind higher. And I think that's indicative of a bull market. When bad news kind of hits uh, in the bear market, this thing would have you know fallen off another cliff, and we would have set a new low. Uh, however, now we're, we're we're continuing to grind higher. Um, so this also happened when uh, you saw Senator Warren, uh, Elizabeth Warren, out of Boston. She kind of published this new bill that she's sponsoring. She's sponsoring a new bill. Her and her, she's a self-proclaimed leader of the anti-crypto army. So they really do want to. You try and get rid of crypto. And, and this bill effectively makes crypto illegal if it gets passed, right? Which I don't think it's going to get passed. Now, I'm not a legal expert, but uh, when I was looking at her track record, she had zero bills that she's ever sponsored actually pass into law. Zero bills that she's ever sponsored in the five years she's been there has ever passed and became a law. Now, of the something like 17 or 1800 laws, or, or sorry, bills that she's co-sponsored, roughly 40 or 45 of those have ever been enacted into law. That's about a two, two and a half percent win rate. So I think she's got pretty low odds here again of getting this bill in its current form passed. But the markets did kind of wobble a little bit, but then continued to go higher. So again, in the, in the bear market, if if this was a bear market, right, that would have shot the prices down violently and everybody would have been freaking out. But we're in a bull market. That's my uh, hypothesis here, that we're in a bull market and that the time is now to be a buyer because bad news can't knock this train off its track. So if you guys are interested uh, in, in, in making boatloads of cash this year, 
and next year. Uh, I highly, highly, highly suggest you guys take a serious look at the crypto markets because they're not slowing down. Uh, in fact, they're only speeding up with momentum rising um, by, by many different metrics. So anyhow, uh, that's all we have for you guys today. Hope you enjoyed today's market update. But also, real quick, uh, if you guys aren't already subscribed to a service where you could get in-depth reports, technical analysis, fundamental analysis on all the, the hottest new cryptos with buy zones and sell zones, um, if you guys want something like that but don't have it yet, well, you're in luck because for $1, you can get a two-week trial to Crypt Nation, okay? Come and see everything that we do for our over 10,000 crypto traders and investors, okay? What we do for them every single day. We are excited about this crypto market and delivering you guys top-tier crypto market research. So again, $1, two-week trial, click the button and come and see.